Well, welcome. I'm Perry Williams, and I'm with Hamilton County TV. We're out here today at the Embassy Suites, where we're having the taste of Noblesville. So it's we just got started. People are starting to come in here and everything. Looks like there's going to be big, big crowd here. They're starting to flow down our side here, and and we're going to walk around a little bit. You still have time to get out here because. They will be here tonight till 7.30. So keep that in mind. Noblesville Taste of Business will run till 7.30. And we're out by the Hamilton Town Center, okay, at the Embassy Suites in their conference area. So come on out and join us here at the Taste of Noblesville. Well, let's just walk around and we'll interview some people here and, and have a little chit-chat. Let's talk, huh? You want to sure. talk? Sure. Live on Hamilton County TV? Oh, live. Yes, I'm live. Always live. <laughs> oh, they want a bag. Yeah, you got to get a bag. Yeah, like we got a bag. All right, cool. Show the bag up there at the camera and everything. All right, all right. Now, tell us your name. My name's Kate Sackers. I'm Kylie Leverett. Welcome, welcome. This is Hamilton County TV. It's going on live on the internet right now, hctv1.com, okay? So we're out here to taste the nobles. Uh, tell us a little bit, I know quite a bit about Gaylord, but tell us a little bit what you got here, what you're doing, and, and some of the great things just going on here in Noblesville with, with Gaylord. Yeah, so we are the largest electrical contractor in Indiana, and we are located right here in Noblesville. Um, so we have, we're actually national, so we have 11 locations nationwide, um, but we do healthcare, industrial work, um, food processing, commercial construction. Um, some of the closer ones we might know here in Hamilton County would be the IKEA and Top Golf. Absolutely. <laughs> now, what else? I know that you have to keep track of uh, Chuck Goodrich and everything since he's at the, the State House, so I know that's a full time job because I. It is a full time job. He's a very busy man, and we love him to death. <laughs> well, I appreciate you, and, uh, and thank you for talking to us and everything uh, here on Hamilton County TV. Thank you. Thank you so much. You didn't want in a picture, huh? You let the gals do that? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Let's move over here to Taylor Systems here. Hello. How are you? I'm all right. How are you tonight? Good. This is Hamilton County TV. Tell everybody your name. Bonnie Dolik. Bonnie, now I know about Taylor Systems, but let's tell the people a little bit about what Taylor Systems actually does. Well, we are uh, locally owned here in Noblesville, and we're an IT solutions company, so we do video surveillance for businesses, door access, we do voice over IP phone systems, and IT services, so we can be the customer's one-stop one stop shop. Well, that sounds great. Looks like there's a pretty good crowd flowing in here, and it's only 4 o'clock. I know. It, the door's just open. That's good. Well, I appreciate you talking with us. Thank you very much. Thank you. Have a good day. All time. right. You too. We'll want to go over here to Farmer's Bank here. Let's go to Farmer's Bank. <laughs> See, I know this gentleman by the name of Sid Loomis, but... Sid, kind of tell us what's going on here uh, with Farmers Bank, and uh, you always dress up at these events, we, right? We do. We have a good time with the, at these ch Taste of Business events, but this year we, we went with the Adams Family theme, and so we had a couple of different things going on. You can either guess how much is in our uh, our little glass coffin and loose change, and there's some folding money in there too, and then uh, we also have a Plinko board going on, so you can win win fabulous prizes at our Plinko board and you just come down here and you say Thing, give me an ice cream scoop mm -hmm. <laughs> and Thing will come Look up at that. with an ice cream scoop. Cool. Thank you Thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty cool. Now talk about a little bit about the business, Sid. Uh, 
how many locations we have around sure. Hamilton County here? Sure. So Farmers Bank actually has a, a, a total of ten locations altogether, but in Hamilton County we have we have three. We've got one in Fishers at 116th and Allisonville, one in Sheridan right at the corner of 47 and 38, and then my branch uh, in Shelby's as well uh, is in Noblesville, right out in front of Walmart, in between Steak and Shake and Starbucks. Well, thank you, Sid, and You're enjoy. Welcome. Thanks, Perry. Well, let's make uh, let's make the rounds here and move on around. You got a minute to talk to us? Sure. <laughs> well, we're live on Hamilton <laughs> County TV, so you hey. can't beat this. <laughs> no. Go ahead and tell us your name. Uh, my name is Jeremy Meyer with Meyer Photography. Gail Loving. <laughs> Welcome. So let's talk a little bit. Tell us a little bit about your photography business, where you're located, and those type of things. Well, we're located in Noblesville here, uh, on the other side of town by the harbors. Uh, and what we do is commercial imagery, videography, uh, advertising pieces, um, anything for business-to-business -business use. Well, do you have a phone number or something that you can tell here? To, how do people can get a hold of you or a website? I've got some cards. It's uh, MeyerPhotography.studio. Uh, and it's M-E-I-E-R is the proper spelling. And our phone number is 317-645-7151. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Take care. You ready, Will? <laughs> Looks pretty good here. Crowd, everything coming in the door here. Looks like it's uh, filling up, steadily coming in here, Will, and the people and everything. Let's walk over here to Imavex. I bet you I can get Carrie Ann to talk to me. Come on, Carrie Ann. Come on, hon. You can do this. This is Carrie Ann Rich. She's with Imavex. Let's talk a little bit about your business and about this uh, taste of business out here at Noblesville. Yeah. So Imavex, we are a digital marketing company. So we build websites and then do everything to drive traffic to your website. So uh, we've been in business. This is our 18th year. Um, so we are actually located in uh, Fishers, but have a big presence in Noblesville as well. Absolutely. I've worked with you many times on, on different projects. So it's good to see you. and and. Uh, Good to see you uh, with Imavax, okay? Yeah, Good to see you. Bye now. I wanted to try to get the famous Judy Johnson, but she's tied up talking. But we'll, we'll get her before we get out of here. I promise you that. This looks like a very popular booth here uh, for us here, uh, 1205. It's a, a new uh, brewery in Hamilton County. I believe it's in Carmel right now and they're also going to have a location in Westfield so it looks like they got a pretty big crowd there you know when you have a when you have drink when you're serving alcohol there it's a pretty big crowd so let's go ahead and let's move on looks like some of these booths are getting kind of crowded here Elmer go ahead and get their sign there and everything Looks like everybody checking out the computers and some of the things that they're doing here. But we'll check we'll check back with them in just a few minutes. Come here, Danny Robinson. I want to talk to you. It's Danny Robinson. This one. That one. <laughs> yeah, can you? Danny Robinson, one of my really good friends and my wife's good friend. And let's talk a little bit about what you're here, out here about today. I guess we ought to move out of the way of your FC Tucker here. 
Go ahead and tell, you, tell us a little bit. Well, we're just out here because we want to help people make moves. And whether that's uh, transitioning from a large home to a small home, or maybe you've outgrown your current home, or maybe you just want to maybe get a second home. Sometimes that's the case. you got a home in Florida and you want to have a home up here so you can be close to the kids. So we're just here trying to help people make moves. Well, I appreciate it. I appreciate you giving us the time here today to do this. Okay, hon? All right. Thank you. Thank you, Danny. Who wants to talk? Who wants to talk? These are my two OBGYNs. I think they will. Talk about what? Just talk about what you're doing out here. Statements and pictures? Yeah, let's talk a little bit. Okay. You're good. Okay. All right, first of all, go ahead and say your name. Uh, Dr. Ebinger. And tell us a little bit about uh, St. Vincent's Fishers. Uh, St. Vincent Fishers is a hospital here in Fishers. It's relatively new. It's been open for about five years or so. We deliver babies there. We have an emergency room there. We have imaging services, an outpatient surgery center. Uh, we have a great cafeteria, too, in case you ever need a little snack. Yes. So, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, not at all. But uh, I'm one of the OBGYNs there, and we great. love delivering babies. That sounds great. And unfortunately, I'm not in that business right now, but uh, but I do have uh, kids and everything. But uh, I want to thank you and everything for coming out here. We're with Hamilton County TV, which is HCTV1.com, and and we broadcast mostly sporting events, but we also do the Noblesville. Uh, city council meetings and also the county council meetings so you can watch us a lot on facebook twitter we're everywhere so i appreciate it thank you for talking with us thank you can you get the picture here will no no oh i just want to show the picture here one of the great places we have uh uh, for uh, the food out here today and everything and uh, they're pretty close out here they're right down the street here right right down the street yeah, right down the street. yeah, yeah. how long how long have you been there uh, we've been there about six months right now yeah, yeah yeah I thought you were pretty new yeah business going well uh, so far so good you know um, up and down but we still keep it strong good good thank you thank you very much thank I appreciate you. it thank you so much Starting to get a little crowded here, Will. Let's slide. Can you slide through here, all right? One of our good friends and my friend, Tom Kinley. Terry Williams, how's it going today? How are you today, buddy? I've already seen you once, haven't I? I, I guess you're asking the questions, sir. Yes, I am asking the questions. Tom, talk a little bit about what you do here in Noblesville. Well, Noblesville, I am the Noblesville Township Trustee. Uh, we help people who need help who are on the bottom end. We pay some rents and utilities and other services and refer them to other community agencies if we can't help them. Well, I appreciate that. How are you enjoying? Good food yet? Oh, great food. Toscano's here is the best, you know. Right. So anyway, this is not a paid commercial. But yeah. It's really good. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, Tommy. Appreciate it. Go Boilers. <laughs> yeah, year. that's right. All right. What do we got here? Noblesville, please. Come on. You know, where would we be without uh, the Nobles of Police? Your name? Uh, Tammy Likovitz and Becky Hadley. How are you both today? Very well. Great. <laughs> so what you got going here? What are we talking about that, that we want the community to know about in uh, Nobles of Police Department? So we're trying to educate on some top topics. We have some bullying. We have cyber safety for kids. Um, we home have safety. home safety, how to do things at the police department. So a lot of good information to help people navigate the city. So you need to stop by the Noblesville Police 
uh, booth here today and then and, uh, and pick up some of this information right yes, absolutely we'd yes. love it all right and we're, you're here till 7 30 tonight That's right. so there's plenty of time to come out we'll be here all night <laughs> thank you i appreciate it thank you how are you today good i'm john john perry williams with hamilton county tv nice to meet you nice meeting you Tell us a little bit about your business. Flex Capital's commercial lender, so we lend money to businesses. Well, that's a good thing, right? It's easy, right? And you're going to be here till 7.30 tonight? All the way till 7.30, yep. We got a couple of giveaways, Amazon gift card and a, a vodka basket. Oh, you can't beat that, so people need to stop by your booth here. That's right. Help grease the wheels. That's right. Thank you. I appreciate it. Nice meeting you. I'll hang on here a minute so we can talk to uh, Julie Kawicki. Uh, she's uh, running, one of the candidates running for mayor. Julia, how are you? I am great. How are you? Good to have you this here is... on Hamilton County TV. Awesome. Yeah. I know. Well, this is just a great event for Noblesville and Hamilton County. I mean, it's, we have such great vendors in Noblesville. I'm glad people are out here and checking out all the great things we have. And I enjoy this being the Embassy Suites out here, all this space and room, and it's starting to get a little crowded. It is. Folks are showing up. I'm looking forward to talking to Noblesville voters and, and, and endorsing my candidacy. So I hope they'll all come talk to me. Of course, you'll be here until 730 tonight, okay? So you'll get plenty of talking in. I hope so. Now, don't you have an event coming up here pretty quick? Well, we had an event at Ginger's last <laughs> night, and then um, we have an event at Greek's Pizza on Thursday, April 25th at... Six o'clock. So okay. we'd love to have them, and also at the Republican breakfast next week. Yeah. Now that Greeks pizza we're talking about—that's the one on, on, on Tenth Street. It is Greeks. Greeks on Tenth Street, Tenth and Cherry. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Stop and think. We're Tenth and Cherry. Yeah. yeah. Um, it'll be from six to seven. So looking forward to having families join us. We'll have some pizza and some great conversation. I see you got some help back here, I huh? Do. I have my very fine son, Josh. Yeah, that's nice. It's it's been exciting for him to. To go this, or you don't know about that yet, right? I don't know if Josh would say it's exciting, but I've appreciated his help. How are you, Josh? You doing fine? I'm doing very well today. How are you? Yeah. You enjoying this? I'm sure. Oh, I am. I'm enjoying seeing my mom take a bigger step in trying to lead our community into a brighter future. Well, that's right. She did a pretty. She did a pretty good job on the school board, so she may be able to do a greater job as mayor. I think that's absolutely correct. Yes. <laughs> good meeting. Hey, Bye now. Come here, come here. Come yes. here. Don't hi Julie. Don't don't show anybody I have this. That's right, that's right. Judy Johnson, how are you today? I, I am great. How are you? Great, great. This is a, a good opportunity for people to showcase Noblesville and all the great things they've got going on here. You are absolutely right, Perry. And this kind of event brings together businesses, nonprofits, organizations, public servants, all together to just say what a great place and what a jewel Noblesville is. You're right. And go ahead and say it. This Embassy Suites is a pretty nice place. Yeah, this was a great project to do. And over ever since they've been here, it's been utilized a lot by Noblesville. Uh, businesses, conferences, the city, everybody. So you've been out here a lot. Yeah, and absol absolutely. And you know, in fact, I hate to even say this, but at the end of the month, our my fiftieth, no, my fiftieth uh, uh, class reunion. So that's pretty exciting. So you're having it here? Yes. At Embassy, a great place to hold a uh, alumni celebration 50 years and you even said it on the camera there Pat. yeah yeah i'm not afraid i'm getting there yeah <laughs> <laughs> but yeah i'm really happy everybody's out here and what a great um the chamber did such a good job with its committee and members making this look fantastic for when you walk in so Im they improve this uh event every year oh absolutely absolutely yeah. well good seeing you Jenny. Yeah, i'm glad you're out here talking All to everybody right. thank All you right. All right, what do we got here? Get this good food here, Will. Come on, come on, who's talking? Who's talking? Hi, Tim Perry Williams, Hamilton County TV. Nice to meet you. HCTV1.com. Okay, Tell us a little bit about the restaurant. Uh, 
I've eaten there, great food. Yeah, it's really good. So it's really unique to this area because it's a Brazilian grill. Basically, it's a bunch of meats that come over on these skewers and they're cutting it up for you. There's a whole salad festival where it's unlimited. They just keep going up. So many different options and you just get so full, we have to basically carry you on a stretcher. It's really cool, really unique. And you're not too far from here. You didn't have to travel far, did you? Street, like we could walk here basically. It's, so it's pretty cool. Look at your employees yeah. hiding back there. <laughs> Yeah, they don't they're a little shy, what it's okay. <laughs> so today what we got are these little Brazilian bowls. We got garlic parmesan beef, turkey wrapped in bacon, grilled pineapple with brown sugar glaze, and then rice and beans on the bottom there. Those are like the most popular items that we got there, especially that grilled pineapple. Well, thank you. I appreciate you taking time out. And you'll be here until 7.30 tonight? Until that time, yeah, for sure. And we're at the Embassy Suites, right? Yeah. And your restaurant, if you want more to eat, yeah. it's right across the street, right? Say hi to us, yeah, and visit us over at the restaurant, too. Yeah. Thank you, I appreciate it. Thank you. Who's talking here? <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. We'll check out all this food and everything. I mean, they got some great food here. Tell us a little bit about Carpenter Realtor and where you're located. We're located at 2270 Greenfield Avenue in Noblesville. I know where that is. That's right there near the Speedway, right? It is right next door to the Speedway. Yeah. Yep. So when you go down 37, you turn at Greenfield Pike and they're right there, right? They're right there, ready to serve. How is uh, real estate sales going? Always amazing. <laughs> Always amazing. Good answer, right? Well, I appreciate you taking time, and you'll be here tonight till 7.30, and we'll be here. looks like you got plenty to eat. We do. You should get in on some of that. They're delicious cookies. Well, my boss is kind of cracking a whip, so Will and I have to do this for a while, and we'll be back, though. Thank you. Wonderful. Thanks so much. Mobile Parks is up here next. We'll uh, talk to them a little bit about... Uh, they got a lot of things, great things going on here uh, in the future and everything with the concerts uh, at Dillon Park and at uh, Federal Hill Commons. So a lot of cool things going on. Uh, we get a second here, we'll uh, talk with Abby and she can tell us a little bit more about some of the things coming up here. Hi, Abby. Perry Williams with Hamilton County TV. How are you? Good, thank you. Tell us a little bit about what's coming on in the park. I know you, with this season coming up, you cannot tell us everything going on. No. But give us a, some of the highlights. Great. Well, we have our summer camps that we've started enrolling, so we're really excited to see how those go this year. It's always a lot of fun and a great way to bring those kids in and have some fun with them over the summer. Um, we have our concert series coming up at Dillon Park and Federal Hill Commons, as well as our food truck Fridays at Federal Hill Commons start in May, and they're the second and fourth Friday of every month. So it's a lot of really fun and exciting things getting ready to happen. I can tell you, food truck Fridays are fun. Yes. I appreciate that. Well, thank you. All right. Well, thank you very much for taking time. I know you're getting busy here. Yes, it's starting to pick up a little bit. Thank you. All right, Judy. So I'm actually Come on, Judy. I'm doing a Facebook Live right now. Oh, my gosh, so we're man. We're, we're all even on we're TV here and everything. Yeah, with Perry. That's cool. So are we. Yeah. Yeah, that's great. Your, your, so sound, we're your sound quality is probably a lot better. <laughs> this is Perry from Ham Hamilton County Television. We're going around. We're interviewing everybody around yeah, here. Yeah, I was about so. to talk to these guys. Are you doing the same thing? Yeah, I go really, ahead. I really just wanted a drink. Oh, okay. All right. Judy, come out here and let's talk a little bit about what, what we got going here. This is Hamilton County Tourism. We partnered with 1205 Distillery and...
all over? No. We're about to where we will, you know. Well, we're back here live. Well, sorry, we had a little bit of battery difficulty here. I'm with Judy at uh, Hamilton County Tourism Booth. Talk a little bit about what we're doing here, about the the menu and everything for uh, 1205. Now, they're a new... They're a new distillery. They're in Fountain Square, but they're from Hamilton County originally, the people that are running it. And so we partnered with them to come up with a drink. Smashes are the latest drink. So we have put together with 1205 a rhubarb liqueur and their own gin that they make. And we've come up with a Hamilton County Smash. That sounds exciting, right? And this drink will be served in some of our partner bars and restaurants. And also there are liquor stores in Hamilton County that will be selling their liquor. Thank you. I appreciate it. Have a good day. Good seeing you. Bye. We were we were over here first of all. We were over here first of all with Hamilton County Park. I mean with Noblesville Parks, but I couldn't. Uh, I got my good friend Brandon here, so let's talk about a little bit of what's going on at at the, at the Noblesville Park. I'm sure you can't tell me everything because it's way too much right now. How much time do you have? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Uh, you know, I've got, I've, we've got a really good team in place, and, and they're putting plans together for the summer right now, beyond our construction projects that we've got going, you know, with park development and, um, you know, some repair work that's come upon us lately. Um, but our summer concerts are, are rolling out, and our food truck Fridays, and all of our summer camps, and... Golf courses are open. Golf courses are open. We just need some weather to... Oh, yeah. They're greening up nicely, though, and uh, in good shape, so uh, it's going well. It's going well. We're busy, but that's a good thing. Thank you, Brandon. I appreciate it. Absolutely. Good seeing you. Crowd's getting kind of uh, pretty good here, uh, going uh, well. A lot of people coming, still coming in the door. A lot of people mingling. A lot of good food here, and everything. So uh, it, it's. Uh, I, I want to stop and get Marty Cook. We're not over at her booth, Hi. but you always want to talk Marty. to Noblesville Schools and Marty uh, Cook. Hi, Welcome. Thank you. How are you doing? It's good to see you here. Great, great. Tell us a little bit about what's going on with the foundation, because. I know you have a booth out here. Yes, we do. Yeah, so this year we have kind of a, as we continue to align ourselves more with the Education Foundation, we have a booth, we're sharing a booth together this year, so Noblesville Schools and the Ed Foundation are there. You can make um, donations that help support grants for teachers and students. You can um, do a teacher recognition, thank a teacher. We've got uh, Miller Man chocolate bars that you can grab, and uh, of course information about Noblesville Schools, um, a lot of cool highlights of some of the different accolades and things that we've accomplished this past year and in information about our internship program and all sorts of good stuff well that's great that's great and uh marty i thank you for uh give us a little talk how's uh tell dr nita meyer and uh dr monday uh we said hello from hamilton county yes, tv all right, I appreciate all right. It. Take care thank you marty Thanks. Gift card courtesy of the Ford Credit Union for Starbucks. And Polly Blake, you got a minute? Yeah, okay. Good seeing you. How we doing here? How we're doing here? How we doing here? Good. We got some pork butt today from uh, Grindstone Public House downtown Noblesville. Well, a lot of good things going at uh, Grindstone uh, Public House. You know, a lot of people don't know. I'm old enough to know. Uh, of course, Blake. Uh, uh, also knows because he grew up a Fargo song, but uh, the one thing about it is uh, Clancy's was was the it was when I was a kid it was the McDonald's. It, it was the spot to go to in, yeah. in Noblesville, and uh, we tried to bring back a little bit of nostalgia with the uh, toppers on the menu at the Grindstone Public House, but we really kind of wanted to bring back some past favorites, but kick it up a notch and make a concept that Noblesville will be proud of for a lot of years to come, hopefully. So so you'll be here till 7.30 tonight and everything going? Yeah. We'll be here till 7.30 tonight. We have pork butt, 
um, at the First Merchants booth. We uh, we paired with First Merchants, so come by and uh, grab some First Merchants gear and uh, register to win a uh, Grind Some Public House gift card. Thank you. I appreciate it. Good Thank seeing you, you again. You. Yeah. All right. Bye now. Okay, who's talking? Come on, girls. Come on. What 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 do we got going on here from Riverview Health? Uh, we're offering a lot of different different healthy snacks. My goodness, that's healthy, right? Yeah, we got to stay on brand. We got to make sure people are healthy. Well, good, good. Well, we appreciate you coming out here. You'll be here till 7:30 tonight. Well, that's great. That's great. Come on out. Thank you. I appreciate it. How are you today? How about talking with us here on Hamilton County TV? We're live uh, right now on Hamilton County TV. Uh, it's HGTV1.com. And uh, let's talk a little bit about what you're out here for. Well, we're with Indiana Tech. We're a regionally accredited nonprofit university. Um, here in this area, we have three locations, one in Fishers, Noblesville, and at the Pyramids. Uh, we cater to working adults uh, so that they can go back to school and get their degrees, continue working, have a family. They go to school one night a week, or they can do it totally online or a combination. Well, that's great. I appreciate you being out here and everything. And It's pretty nice out here at the Embassy Suites, isn't it? It's great. Yes. Well, thank you for the information and good luck. I'm here uh, with another candidate uh, to talk to Chris Jensen. Hey, Perry. Hi, Chris. How are you? Talk to me. You want to talk to <laughs> Just you got to come back and talk to me. All right. Perry Williams, how are you? Good, how about you? I'm having a great time. This is the place to be tonight. Absolutely. Let's talk a little bit about it. You're on the city council yeah. now. Get, you're running for mayor. Let's talk about this embassy suite. Oh, it's incredible. You know, we a few years ago realized that we didn't have any conference space really in the city of Noblesville. So the city partnered with uh, Embassy Suites to get this built over here and, and look what it's done for not only Exit 210 but the city as a whole. This is a beautiful facility and I invite anyone who hasn't been here yet to come check it out. Um, and it's really going to be an asset to Noblesville going forward. And I bet you'll be here till 7.30 shaking hands, right? I won't go until the last voter leaves, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Chris, let's talk a little bit about because this is a big boost for us here in that that public private kind of partnership here is a good thing. It's an absolute good thing. You know, I, I think when we identify our needs going forward, we need the public sector and, and the private sector to work together to get that accomplished. Government is not the answer most of the time. The private sector has to come alongside us and help us fill a need. And that's what you're seeing here at the Embassy Suites. Um, you're going to see it with other projects going forward that uh, that public-private partnership is key to the future, not only of really the city of Noblesville, but the state of Indiana going forward. You have to be proud of your chamber. This is a great event. It's incredible. Like I said, anyone who is in Noblesville is not here. They're missing out. They're, you know, I don't know what they're eating for dinner, but there's a lot of good options out here. Well, if you we got till 7.30. We have Rosie's Cookies at our booth, so stop by and see us. All right. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, Appreciate Perry. it. Have a good night. Thank you, you too. All right. Who's talking here? Why do I always get this? Why do I always get this? Man, grilled cheese and everything, man, let's Let's talk up a little bit about this. Dad, come on up here and talk about your creation. So, come on, cheerleader. We're featuring a roasted tomato bisque with a basil oil and a three cheese grilled cheese and a secret ingredient sprinkled on top. Wow, that sounds exciting. That sounds exciting. Tell us a little bit about your business. So, Purgatory Golf Club, we're a golf club open to the public. Um, in addition to doing local golf uh, in a uh, wonderful and very challenging golf course, we also feature banquets and catering events. Uh, we average about 25 weddings or more a year. And on top of that, we also do wine dinners every single month. 
This month we're actually focusing a wine dinner that is on southern French wines. Uh, we're doing a five course pairing this particular go around and our theme rotates every single month. So we're doing something neat every month with wines. Next month we're focusing on Toad Hollows, uh, which is a Southern California winery. So uh, if you haven't checked us out or haven't heard of us before, we do have uh, a website that you can come check us out, Purgatory Golf Club. Um, otherwise, uh, feel free to look us out and see what fun things we have going on. Sounds exciting, and I believe you also host chamber events out there in our meetings. We do host chamber events. Typically, every month or every other month, we do chamber luncheons. So if you are part of the Noblesville Chamber of Commerce, we'd love to see you out there. Definitely see what you bring to the table. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it, David. Thank you. What do we got going on here, John? We got Star Financial Bank. We got some uh, koozies and frisbees and pop sockets and some lovely, thank you, Vanna. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he's playing Hannah, right? Vanna, why? We yeah. got uh, Enter to win a $50 gift card to Mateo's on the square. Sounds great, sounds great. What do you think about this event out here at the Embassy Suites? It's fantastic. It's a great space. I, I got to go to the Fishers one last year and the Nobles one, Noblesville one as well. Um, it's a wonderful space. The music's great. Food's great. Can't complain. That's right. You can't ever complain when there's food, right? Right, right. absolutely. All right, thank you. I appreciate it, John. Erie Insurance, and we'll talk a little bit with uh, with them a little bit. Well, I'm with Hamilton County TV. What we got going here? Oh, hi there. We are Merritt Point Group Insurance, and we offer all these coverages: auto, homeowners, boat, getting ready for boating season, life, business, whatever you need. Give us a call. Well, I appreciate that, Jody. It looks like. Uh, Great event here, right? It is. It's a fantastic turnout. Plus, you get to network with a lot of people. Yes, yes, we do. Meeting a lot of nice people here today. All right. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. How are you? How are you? Good, good. What we got going here at Bolden's? Carpet cleaning. Carpet cleaning. We're giving away free spotter today. Stain remover. If you guys are interested, it goes pretty quick. I would grab a bottle. Now you'll be here till 7:30, right? So, yeah. so there's plenty. Of t there is no excuse time, that they can come out here. Tell us a little bit about where you're located and everything. And and Bolin's has been around for a long time here in Noblesville. That's right. So we've been around for almost 20 years now. We're located right off of State Road 32 in Noblesville. As you can see, this is what we do as a company. We mainly specialize in restoration service, so water, fire damage repair, stuff like that. And then over here on our cleaning services, we do carpet cleaning, upholstery cleaning, tile and grout cleaning, drapery cleaning, you know, all that good stuff. So. And then this is a new thing that we're yeah, offering. I saw as that. I saw to, that. Yeah, we're starting to sell hardwood floors and carpet and pads. So you know who to call if you need carpet. Absolutely. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. We're going to slide by here and talk to some more people. Hang on a minute. i got to run over here and throw something away in, in the trash because it was leaking in my pocket. Go ahead. I'll be back. I'll be back. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's talk a little bit about what we're doing here because this is a huge, huge part of what Noblesville is all about. It was Noblesville Serve. Well, I, I would love to share a little bit about Serve Noblesville. This year it's from June 26th to the 29th, Wednesday through a Saturday. And um, we had about 650 volunteers last year with 50 or 60 projects across the city. And uh, they vary from home repair projects that um, some of those uh, projects require some skill. Some of those, if you can pick up, you know, some junk along the side of the road and put it in a bag, um, you can help out. We've cleaned some of the uh, brick sidewalks. Uh, we have Craft with a Cause, which um, women, children, some men are involved in that as well, and uh, doing different crafts. They send those overseas, as well as locally for some mission causes and uh, powerful impact in the community and beyond. And the one thing about it, it makes you feel very happy of what you've accomplished here for Nova Center. Yeah, well, I appreciate that. We love partnering with um, Habitat for Humanity, Main Street, uh, the Parks and Rec Department, as well as the schools, and I've really enjoyed some partnerships with businesses. So if there's schools, 
Uh, other churches want to be part of it. Um, businesses can bring groups to serve. Anyone that wants to come out and serve, uh, we'd love to go to servenoblesville.com where you can check out all our projects that are live and continue checking those out as we'll be adding new projects um, as we add those to the list. You can sign up there for register. We meet at the Noblesville Fairgrounds um, at 8 a.m. June 26th through June 29th. You can sign up for a project there and head out with your team. Sounds great. All right. Well, thank Check you. it out. So Thanks much. a lot. Yeah, don't miss it. All right. Thank you. Let's go this way, uh, Will, and we'll head down this back row here, see what's going on. How are we doing today at Sam's Club, huh? Tell us a little bit about Sam's Club and, and what all you got going. Okay, so Sam's Club does wholesale and we are located on 96th Street and today we're signing people up with extra offers. We have a $10 gift card for signing up new and special benefits, uh, free rotisserie chicken, free pizza. So. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. It sounds like it's good. It's great to have Sam's Club up here at, at Noblesville doing this Taste of Noblesville. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. How are you? Looks like you got a lot of good food here. Tell me a little bit about what we're doing here and, and also a little bit about uh, your five-star residence. Well, Five Star Residence um, of Novusville is uh, Senior Living, uh, located here in Novusville on State Road 32. And we wanted to offer some of the samples that we make the residents for special events. Here. Well, this really looks good. I, I appreciate you uh, coming out here. This Embassy Suites is a pretty nice venue, don't you think? Yes, absolutely. More All right. Thank you. I appreciate it. We'll just make our way down through here. Who's talking? Hi. How are you? What do we got here and what's going on? This is a new restaurant located right beside Aspen Creek. So we're a Asian fusion. Our sushi chef worked with Morimoto. Oh, so we okay. bring in a very different taste to the sushi scene here in Noblesville. Well, I appreciate you. Uh, coming out here and isn't this a great venue and you didn't have to travel very far did you no no we're all local we try to hire local people as well no but i mean as far as your restaurant it's right here it's right next door <laughs> well that's great so keep that in mind this this new restaurant is right next door to the embassy suite so that'll be easy to identify right, right. thank you i appreciate it What do we got going here? Hi. Hi there. Hi, how are you? I'm great. How are you? Tell us a little bit about what you're doing here today. Hi. Perry Williams with Hamilton County TV. Hi. Nice to meet you. Uh, we are Ruoff Home Mortgage in Noblesville. And if you're familiar, we have the Ruoff Home Mortgage Music Center. that everybody Which is right here. Yeah, right here in Noblesville. So we have the fortunate opportunity to help people become homeowners by partnering them with the right loan to fit their needs. Well, I appreciate that. Enjoy today here at the Embassy Suites. Thank you. Tell us a little bit about the Shooting Academy here. Well, we're located at State Road 32, west of 31. We offer classes. We have 10 pistol lanes and 5 rifle lanes. We offer hourly weight, hourly, sorry not used to this. I know. That's okay. Hourly rates. Our rates are $12 for a half hour for pistols, $17 for an hour. We rent handguns. We rent long guns. So so business going pretty good? Yes, sir. We're getting better every day. Well, that's good. Thank you. I appreciate it. How are we doing today? What we got going here? Oh, I'm doing excellent. How are you? Good, 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 good. Tell okay. me a little bit about your business. Sure, Insperity works with America's best small and medium-sized businesses. Been around 33 years, and we offer small businesses the resources and the, the ability not only to attract top talent, but retain their top talent. Now, whereabouts are you located? We're Keystone in the Crossing, but we're headquartered out of Houston, Texas. All right. Well, thank you very much, and I appreciate you coming up here. Absolutely. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Boy, this looks good. 
good, man. Let's talk a little bit about Hula Hands. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, we are located in the Hamilton Town Center. Uh, we've been in the same location for 11 years. We're one of the first uh, 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 first doors, first restaurants in the area. Has it been that long? Golly! I know, I know. It goes fast, right? Absolutely. So, yeah, we love it. We, we love the Chamber of Commerce. They, uh, they do a great job. And well, we're Hamilton County TV. We're internet-based. We do a lot of broadcasting of sports, but we also do the city council meetings and the county council meetings. So uh, we try to give back to uh, our community and everything just like you guys do. it. This is a great venue. Yeah, it's awesome. They do an awesome job. So we're happy to be here. Thank you very much. Will, this may be something you want to do here now, man. Let's talk about... Tell me a little bit about this business. Last UFC gym. Yeah. Last UFC gym with high intensity interval training and boxing classes. And whereabouts are you located? 140, 146 in Hazeldale. Okay, I know where that is. I know where that is. Are you ready to sign up? Uh, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Now, Will may do it. Will? Come over. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you. Thank you for taking time. Thank you. What's Mateo's got here today? Sir, today, Mateos, we brought our war-winning tortellini Mateos. So it has the original recipe of our homemade Alfredo sauce, ham, mushroom, but we brought two versions of it. We also brought the vegetarian version without the ham. Well, that's cool. That's cool. Everything's going all right. Always great at Mateos. It's always great at Mateos. It's always great at Mateos. Well, thank you for being out here. Isn't this a great venue out here? Very great venue. Beautiful venue as well. Um, we're happy to be here. And thank you for having us here today. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, here's my favorite. I do not start my day in Noblesville in the morning until I go to Noble Coffee. So let's, who's talking? Robin, you're talking? Hi, Ricky. Tell us a little bit about what's going on, the exciting things, some of the big improvements you've made to Noble Coffee. Yeah, well, Mark's better talk about improvements. I go ahead, Mark. We've been remodeling, so if you haven't been down to see us in a while, we've had a lot of changes in the last six months. Uh, a lot of them uh, updates in our dining room, so it's a nice, bright, clean space to to meet with friends, study, uh, enjoy a cup of coffee, and we just got a new espresso machine a couple weeks ago. So Harry's gonna be little by guest little by little, yeah, you'll have to learn. Yeah. So, Robin, tell us a little bit about some of the some of the things you got going. As far as your, you got some new teas now and, and selling uh, coffee like crazy. Well, we uh, recently launched a line of some organic loose teas, so we've kind of de debuting that tonight. And then we've also have a par partnership with Chamber of Commerce, so it's kind of coffee for a cause. So a portion of the sales of the bag go towards Noblesville students and healthcare, and then also it benefits um, the same in the pr countries where the coffee is produced in El Salvador and Ethiopia. So you can buy the coffee and feel good about it, and it tastes really good. So. Well, good. I appreciate it, and isn't this great out here, this this venue? It's busier than last year, so it's really nice. Well, that's good. Thanks a lot. No, I'm, I'm, good. I'm good right now. Thank you, though. I'll be back around. Oh, yeah. Stephen Craig, and uh, tell you a little bit about, he's older than I am. Yes, so, so let's talk a little bit about your business. Uh, my wife and I. Uh, started this 30 some years ago from her parents and um, it's, it's been a blooming business ever since. <laughs> Steve is very involved in a lot of different uh, different things around Noblesville and, and uh, a great partner here uh, and really believes in Noblesville. Yes, very much so. You know, Lions Club and First Presbyterian Church and was on the uh, Cultural Arts Council for a few years and stuff. So yes, very much so. Tell us a little bit about where you're located and everything. We're two blocks east of the courthouse on Connor Street, 3238, going through town. Uh, it's an 1890 version house. Uh, we uh, have all the wares and stuff there. We deliver Indian Noblesville, Indianapolis, Carmel, Westfield, all those places too. So, got quite, quite a reach. Well, thank you, Stephen. I appreciate it, good friend. Good to see you again. All right, thank you.
Let's catch it a couple of other ones here. Got the Asian Grill. Asian Grill's open back up here. There, it looks like they're serving uh, some pretty good food, looks like here. Let's talk to Hamilton Town Dentistry. Who's talking? Why do I always get this? Everybody's pointing. Tell me a little bit about what's going on and what you're doing here, here at the Hamilton Town Dentistry. We're just... <laughs> We're just trying to get some new patients into our office. We're located over at the Hamilton Town Center right over here. Well, that's good. That's good. Are you excited about this? Pretty nice event here. Yeah, of course. Great. We all showed up. <laughs> so so we got plenty of time, and you can stop by here. You'll be here till 730, so get familiar. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. All right. Let's kind of slide through here a little bit because there's a lot of a lot of people around here and many storages depot, the forum credit. What do we got going here? Good. I'm Perry Williams with Hamilton County TV. Tell us a little bit about what your business is. Yeah, absolutely. So we're uh, Next Spine, we're right down the street, two blocks away. What we do is we specialize in in-house manufacturing of all spinal implants and related products. So if you see right here, this is a model of a spine. So what we'll do is we'll create the screws and all the rods necessary to fuse the back as well as the implants that will go into it. And um, one of our most recent innovations in the industry is uh, 3D printed titanium. So back in the day, the, it, the status quo was a plastic implant, but nowadays everybody's 3D printing. And so what we've done is we've concocted a technology called Next Matrix, and what it's used for is essentially a playground for bone to grow on. So when a surgeon uses this implant, He's going to put it in between two vertebral bodies, and the bone is going to grow straight through that and fuse, um, which is pretty cool because it's going to expedite patient time and ultimately result in healthier humans, which is pretty sweet. We do all of our manufacturing in-house. Uh, we're looking to employ people, so if anybody's in the area and needs a job, come on in we're right down the street. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. You have a good one. Well, let's get a few more before we take a break. Tell us a little bit about Prairie Lakes. Prairie Lakes is a uh, senior community, living community, and we offer assisted living, memory care assisted living, adult daycare services, respite stays, um, we do short term rehab, and skilled nursing at our place. We're at the corner of 146th and Cumberland Road. Um, Yes, and we'd love to see you. Stop by. Thank you. And you enjoying this out here? This is Good networking, right? Wonderful, yes. For sure. I've met so many new people, um, so many new businesses that I had no idea about. So it's a wonderful event, for sure. Good. I think everybody's benefited with the networking. Absolutely. Absolutely. Thank you. I appreciate it. I want to catch Dr. Niedemeyer before she slips away from me here. She's talking as, as so we'll get her on here in just a minute here. Looks like a great crowd here today. Well, I, I, you know, a couple of comments we've had that this is a a bigger crowd than, than last year and that's always a good thing so it looks like uh, we've got a good crowd out here and then we have a Dr. Niedemeyer see I tracked her down I'm, this is she is a fantastic superintendent does a great job but this is not one of her favorite things to do <laughs> Thanks, Perry. It's always great seeing you. <laughs> Good seeing you. It's 
My friend, Dr. Mundy, doing well? Dr. Mundy is doing great. He's busy, 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 but he's doing great work for us. We're honored to have him. Yeah. I talked to Marnie earlier, and she was talking about Noblesville School Foundation. Things are going well in Noblesville right now. Oh, my gosh. We are doing so well right now with hiring our new safety director, hiring our mental health coordinator. We posted the social worker positions. We are cranking it out. Well, good. Thank you very much for Thank taking time. Care. All right. Good Thank seeing you. Take care. Let's slide down here and we'll talk to another one of our mayoral candidates, uh, Mr. Mike Corbett. Then we'll take a break here. Mike, of course, is here campaigning, so we'll catch him here in just a second and see uh, see what he has to say. Uh, Mike, welcome, Thank sir. You. How are you? I'm fine. I think you're kind of familiar with Hamilton County TV, aren't you? I, I know all about you guys. Yeah, I've spent some time down at your uh, down at your studios. Mike, at, at one time, had a show until he's got so dang busy now you don't have time to do it. That's right. Well, you know, we still do it every now and then, but I think it's probably been about six months since we've done anything. I, I actually, uh, I think I did some interviewing at one of the previous ones of these in the past, if I'm not mistaken. I, absolutely, you're correct. I, I think I did. Yeah. Talk a little bit about the magazines, though, because that's your business. My business is the business magazines. That's right. Can I talk about my candidacy or no? Absolutely. All right. Well, the business magazine is what I've been doing here for 10 years. You know that. It's a, I have two magazines. One's a business uh, called the Hamilton County Business Magazine. It's a business-to-business -business publication. And if people are interested in marketing to other businesses, it's a, great, it's a great way to advertise to them. And then we do a community guide for Hamilton County. But, of course, the big thing and the thing that's been occupying all my time for the past six months is I'm running for mayor. And uh, that's something that, uh, you know, the election day is less than a month away now, May 7th. Uh, just been, been working on that, trying to get my message out. You know, I think it's time for a little bit of change in Noblesville, and I'd like to be the man to make it happen. Well, I appreciate that, and I appreciate you taking time out and, uh, and talking with us. Well, I appreciate you coming around. And All right, right thank, you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. See you. Let's swing right around here to Ginger's. And Well, I want to say here we're at uh, we're at the Embassy Suites at uh, Taste of Noblesville. Uh, we've been going around interviewing people for about uh, the last hour and 15 minutes. So we're going to take a break because it's getting kind of crowded in here, and uh, hopefully we'll be back on the air. But I appreciate. It. Just keep in mind we're at the Embassy Suites, and they'll be open till 7:30. So get out here and take a look at all these great places that have great food and there's great businesses out here that are willing to talk and tell you what's going on. So this is Perry Williams along with Will Walford and uh, we appreciate you uh, tuning in but we'll still be here till 7.30 at the Embassy Suites for a taste of Noblesville. Thank you.